Hi, uh, today we'll look at uh, the BOR model. Uh, the most important equation to come from BOR's model is the expression of energy levels available in the, uh, in the electron of uh, hydrogen atom. E is equal to negative 2.178 times 10 minus 18 joule z squared over n squared. So this is our equation one, where uh, n, n is the energy level or an integer, an integer, one, two, three, goes up to uh, infinity. And z is the nuclear, nuclear charge. Uh, in this case, uh, the nuclear charge for hydrogen is equal to, is equal to one. Uh, the the negative sign the negative sign is, is simply means uh, simply means that uh, the the energy uh, of the electron bound to the nucleus is lower than it would be if the electron were at an infinity distance from the nucleus where there is no interaction and the energy is zero so as n uh, approaches infinity the energy of the system becomes zero E is equal to negative uh, 2.178 times 10 minus 18 joule uh, z squared uh, over uh, infinity. Uh, infinity z, uh, any, any number divided by infinity is equal to 0 times this number is equal to uh, 0. So this is our equation 2. So the change in energy levels uh, or change in energy uh, between two energy levels uh, can be calculated as uh, uh, the difference between energy in the final state minus energy in the initial state, which is the same as energy delta E is equal to negative 2.178 times 10 minus 18 uh, joule, uh, 1 over n final squared minus 1 over ni squared. So this is the equation that we shall use to calculate the energy levels between two states when the electron uh, changes state. So as an example, uh, let's look at uh, uh, one question. Uh, calculate uh, calculate um, the change. Calculate the change in the energy. Calculate the change in the energy uh, uh, when an electron, when when an electron, when an electron, when an electron moves uh, from n equal to four to n equal to two. So we we'll say uh, delta E is equal to negative two point one seven eight times 10 minus 18 joule over 1 over n squared final minus 1 over ni squared initial. So which is equal to negative 2.178 times 10 minus 18 joule over 1 over n final, which is 2. So we say 2 squared minus 1 over Four squared. So first of all, deal with the brackets. So we have negative 2.178 times 10 minus 18 joule, which is equal to 0 0.25 minus 0 0.0625. So when you do the computation, you will find that uh, our delta E is equal to negative uh, 4.08 times 10 minus 19 Joules. So this is the, the, the change in energy when the electron moves from n equal to 4 to n equal to 2. So uh, the negative sign simply means, uh, simply shows the direction of the energy. So in this case, uh, this is emission. There is an emission of a, a photon when the electron moves from n higher level to lower level, level that is emission. Then when the electron moves from, from, from lower 
to hire that is uh, it absorbs it absorbs the uh, effort okay so this is how we can calculate the energy between two energy levels so in the next tutorial we'll, we'll look at uh, the, how we can calculate the wavelength of the emitted photon or absorbed photon thank you